These are the remains of an old Tacoma sawmill. These slowly disintegrating concrete foundations These rotting pilings. The entire Tacoma waterfront used to be inhabited by sawmills. From the 1850s to the 1970s, over 30 mills occupied the stretch. At their peak, they processed 100 million board feet of lumber per day. For years, Tacoma, Washington was lauded as the lumber capital of America. One of the longest lasting of the mills was the Dickman Mill. Hi guys, I'm Pine Top Jackson. I'd like to say welcome to my exploration channel. My family has lived here near Tacoma for going on 10 years now. I was fascinated by the ruins of the Dickman Mill when I first saw them. I'll share some history with you and show you some recent footage of this really cool place. Stay tuned. The Dickman Mill was built in 1889, and it was in business for over 80 years. It employed a lot of people throughout the years. There's still people living in Tacoma who remember every weekday, 7.45 a.m., the whistle would blow <coughs> to signify the start of the workday, Monday through Friday. It could be heard for miles. And then at 4.30 p.m., the whistle would blow again, quitting time. It survived the Great Depression and went on to thrive, but eventually closed down for good in 1977. Then a fire in 1979 destroyed all of the wooden buildings. Now all that's left are the concrete foundations and the pilings out in the Puget Sound. Metro Parks Tacoma bought the site of the mill in the early 1990s. For 20 years it has been working, slowly but surely, to develop the remains into a public park that celebrates Tacoma's heritage as lumber capital of the world. Here's some footage taken a few years ago, before the park was complete.
Oh, we'll go back that way. Look at this circle, though. Oh, really? I think it'd be cold though. Mm -hmm. I could like sleep under the grass. The park was completed in July 2021. The 15-ton head saw had been removed from the mill years ago, but it was saved from the scrapyard and put into storage. It is now returned to its original home, along with an artistic rendition of a giant Pacific Northwestern log sculpture to show how the saw was used back when the city of Destiny was also called the lumber capital of the world. Oh, Daddy, don't go! Don't get to it! <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's sending you. 